Wix Modelist Review 2022. Is Wix any good for dropshipping? Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to go over Wix Modelist. So Wix has this application called Modelist that they have specifically for their dropshipping needs of their clients. And we're gonna take a look and see if it is actually worth the money or not. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is actually click on start for free over here. And we're gonna get started with Wix Modelist. I'm gonna show you guys how to set up your account. And then I'm gonna tell you all about their different uh, plans that are available on Wix model list. So over here, I'm just going to fill out these details and I'm just going to enter up my email and my basic information. So I'm just going to do that and I'm just going to add a password. So it's very simple information. You don't need to give out your um, any kind of specific um, important personal information. It's just basic name and email. And then you're going to say what kind of customer base do you have. So if most of your customers are located in America, you're going to add that. And then you're going to add where you have your e-commerce store. So if it is on Wix, if it's on Shopify, or if it's on BigCommerce or any other platform, and you can add the platform over here. But we're just going to continue with Wix. And I'm just going to click on sign up over here. And now this will open up model list for retailers. So obviously, if you're looking to do drop shipping with Wix, you are looking to find different suppliers. So you're actually just reselling the supplier product and uh, Modelist is going to help you in finding those products and simplifying the dropshipping process. So first off, you can see that this is going to be your basic dashboard once you set up your store. And what you're going to do is you can see all you have is your find product section. If you scroll down, you have some basic recommendations of, depending on the uh, browser cookies that you already have. And then you can just search for any kind of product over here. So let's just say I want to search for a hairdryer. So if I just search for hair dryer and what it's going to do is I'm just going to scroll down after doing this. And then you can see over here, I have different products that are recommended to me by Wix Modelist. And the thing with Wix Modelist is that they provide you with a third party platform for you to actually take a look at the product. So what this will do is this will help you in just finding out different products that are top tier on platforms like Alibaba or AliExpress. So you can see that once I take a look at a product, so let's say it is this product over here, which is a silent hair, hair blower. And if I open it up, you're going to be able to see different details. So you have your item costs, you have your shipping rate, you have retail price, and then you have profit. So you can order a sample or click on add to import list to import the item. And then below that, you have the stock number. So how many of these items are present in stock, the color, size, and um, general sizings and see all different variants for this product. Then you have your Alibaba um, description. So you can see you have details about Alibaba and then the overall seller details. So this person joined in March of 2021 and has a 5.0 rating. Now, after that, you have your returns and below that you have a detailed description box, variant shipping and returns box. So this will help you in generally managing your drop shipping business. Now, if we take a look at the my product section on the left over here and on your left, you have your model list navigation bar. So you're going to find all of your Wix model list settings over here. And if I just click on the my product section, this will open up and show you guys the products that you already have on your e-commerce store, whichever one you have linked. I haven't linked mine currently, but this is going to help you in uh, seeing those and managing those products. So let's say if I go into the find product section and I like a product, what I can do is I can save that product for later on so I can monitor it later on or see the prices or compare it later on. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take these heels over here. I'm going to open this up and what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to click on add to import list and now if i click on view and import list which is my my product section you can see over here i have this product added onto my import list which will help me in importing different products or adding these products to my wix or any other e-commerce store that i'm running now below that you have your sync list as well and your sync list is basically the second step from your import list so once you have products that are added to your import list you can move them to the sync list which are being imported and then you have your archive list so any products that were removed from your store 
will be present over here and then you can later on if you choose to um, re-add those products onto your e-commerce store you can add those as well now below that you have your pricing rules and on your pricing rules you have just general guidelines on how to price your different uh, items so you can see over here for independent brands you have a markup of 1.67 which is the suggested retail price of the item so you don't want to increase prices by like a lot because that will actually make it difficult for you to get sales. And this is why the pricing rules in Wix Monolist are very good and very helpful. Now, below that, you have your order section. Over here, you can manage all of your orders. You don't have to actually open up your uh, e-commerce store to manage your products or orders. You can just manage them from over here. Below that, you have your inbox. So any kind of messaging or communication that you have with your suppliers are, is going to be present onto your inbox. And after that, you have your general order details. So you can just connect your store, view Alibaba and AliExpress directly. Then you have your managed store plan, your store profile, business information, user settings, and logout. So you can manage all of your e-commerce needs basically from the Wix model list platform. Now, we have seen how the Wix Modelist platform works, how you can browse products, add products and order products, uh, insert your e-commerce business, but how much does it really help you in setting up your business? Because you can do a lot of these things for free and how does Wix Modelist really stack up for the features that it's providing? Well, if we take a look at the pricing of a Wix model list, you can see that if you start up as a hobby, it is free. So the best part about this is the features that I just showed you guys, you can get all of those for free on their hobby version where you get a 5% transaction fee. So there is like a higher transaction fee and you have non-premium suppliers only. You have a 25 product limit and then you can add products in one click, import all information, real-time product updates. You can edit product information, do all that good stuff. And then you also have pricing automations with automated markups and um, you can uh, have a specific profit calculator as well for each independent product. So for the free version, I think Wix Model List is such a great application for you to use in your dropshipping business. Now, if we take a look at their $35 startup version where you also get a lot more, so you also have a variety of product and you also have non-premium suppliers only but they have a 250 product limit so you can add 250 products with your Wix model list store from the $35 startup plan and this is the basic difference between the hobby and the startup then on the pro version you have all access so you can get access to premium suppliers provided by Wix model list and then you can add well-known brands and they will obviously give you a shorter shipping time with their brand name and this will allow you all access to products you will get a uh, no product limit so you can add as many products on the pro version which is for $90 on the Wix model list platform so in general I do find that Wix model list is a great application to use for their drop shipping needs you can start out with zero dollars and if you're really expanding your business where 25 products are a lot of products and if you do want to expand you always have the option to do so so that is why I do definitely recommend Wix model list to someone that is starting off with drop shipping and wants to make it a bit more easier and manageable however if you are looking to upgrade on their premium versions i would suggest that just take a look at your products and your needs and if you do feel like you do need the extra product space if you have like a over like 50 products and you want to import 50 products then maybe you should definitely upgrade but if you do have a smaller product catalog if you don't want that many products in your store the free version will definitely suffice so that was it for today make sure to leave a like and subscribe and i will catch you guys in the next video.